Wow. There's no hotels like this in Harmony. I'll say. Yeah, whatever it is Lena wants us to do, she's definitely sparing no expense to put us up to do it. Yeah, it's too bad we can't enjoy Rome. Look, this could be Moscow for all I care. All right, Maya? I just want to get our little mission over and done with so we can get back to Harmony and I can make things right with Fancy. God, she has to believe that, that I only broke up with her because I, I wanted to keep her safe. You know, that we're working with the FBI to help them nab Lena. God, I will die. I will kill myself if, if I ruin my relationship with Fancy over this cloak and dagger nonsense we're mixed up in. Sorry, Noah. I can't let you tell Fancy the truth, or we'll all end up dead. Think you're ready to show off with our fancy luggage and gaudy jewels? She makes me sick. Hi. What beautiful luggage you have here. Wow, of such quality, and your jewels. Almost as bad as you are. Oh, grazie, Luigi. Prego, prego. So, uh, what brings you to Roma this time? Is it a prince? A football player? Neither. I'm here to work. Love is the last thing on my mind. No. A beautiful woman such as yourself must have love, or you will wither like a Sandra Tomato. Well, I had love back in the States, but um, the man broke my heart. <gasps> Disgraziato. You know, I have a cousin in New York. From Brooklyn. He could break this guy's kneecaps if you want me to. Oh, oh, thanks. But I'll be happy never to see him again. <laughs> oh, my God. What are you doing here? Esme! What are you doing in Rome? As many men as possible, dear. <laughs> I'm available, signorina. I'm hearing voices. I hope you're not still mad. Oh, for letting me think that Lord Sarney was set to propose so that I'd leave for England, leaving you with that yummy hunk of a man flesh. Noah? You were pretty upset uh, when you found out I tricked you. Was I? You tried to kill both Noah and me. What are you doing? <laughs> well, originally I was going to go moose hunting with Daddy. But now I have another head that I want on my wall. <laughs> <laughs> I was in a mood, wasn't I? Well, lucky for you and Noah, my aim was off that evening. But it's much better now. Oh, nice room. Okay. Now, if Lena would just call. Please try to be patient, Noah. We just got here. Maya, don't talk to me about patience, okay? I want this thing over with, whatever it is. I mean, we got the FBI, you know, breathing down our necks, trying to get us to help them implicate Lena in some terrorist plot. We've got Lena threatening us every two seconds if we don't find her partner's killer. Get back whatever it is they stole from the trunk in that attic. Look, I hate that you're involved with this. You and me both. Why don't we go for a walk? See Rome at night? And risk missing Lena's call. No. I want to find out what our mission is so that we can do it, get it done, go back to Harmony. And you can help rebuild your mother's restaurant, and I can try to rebuild my relationship with Fancy. How did it come to this, huh? How did I end up in the most romantic city in the world without Fancy being here to share it with? I just wish Lena would call. Do you remember when we were dating in college? And we talked about moving here, to Rome, after we graduated. Were we drinking wine or beer that night? No, I... We were serious. Yeah, if you say so, I really don't remember. 
It was so easy to dream then. You know, anything seemed possible. You know, I bet Lena's deliberately not calling just to remind us she's the one calling the shots. Try to be patient. Yeah, right. The longer this thing drags on, the longer Fancy has to believe that I purposely used her and that I left her for you. God, ring, damn it, ring! So we can go back to Harmony and fix things. I'm sure she'll call soon. These fancy safe. Back in the States, out of harm's way. Ow! Oh, that hurt! Good. Just be glad Customs confiscated my rifle. Or they'd be making room for you in the nearest catacomb. Esme, I said I was sorry over what happened with Noah. I should have told you we'd been involved the second you set your sights on him. Yes, you should have. Instead of letting me make a fool of myself, coming on to a man that didn't want me. I'd be honored to pleasure you, signorina. There's that voice again. I thought you'd make fun of me for being involved with someone out of our class. Well, there was a time when I would have. But since Lord Sarney's mother dissed me for not being titled, I've become much more egalitarian. So, if Noah makes you happy, then by all means... Enjoy riding that big wooden arc of his. Well, Fancy, what is it? Um, uh, Noah left me. Unavailable, Miss Crane. Where is that voice coming from? Maybe I should have my medication adjusted again. But n now, Fancy, why on earth would Noah leave you? To go back to his old girlfriend? I caught them in bed together, Esme. I caught Noah making love to another woman. Oh, poor Fancy. Oh, and poor me for not being that other woman. If you were hoping to see some woman-on-woman -woman action, forget it. Now take Miss Crane's luggage to her suite. Too sweet. Si, sí, signorina. Oh, and don't forget your tip. Ah, si, sí, pego. Cashmere will be the new silk. <laughs> you can take that one to the bank. <laughs> oh. Hmm. oh, poor Fancy. Broken hearted over losing Noah to another woman. Life can be so hard at times. Yes, it can. Now, you just remember, you deserve this for deceiving me over Lord Sarney's proposal. Esme, I'm sorry. Can you ever forgive me? Well, the way I hold a grudge... Oh, it's doubtful. <laughs> but I'll try. Thanks. <laughs> Let me buy you a conciliatory drink. Oh, well, a bottle of Cristal would be lovely to start with. Hmm. Who said you can't put a price on friendship? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, what? Oh, I just saw Gianni come into the lobby. The legendary Roman Romeo? Yes. I don't want him to see me. Why not? Legend has it that he is the best lover in all of Italy. Oh, well, that's just it. Johnny thinks he's God's gift to women. Because he is. He tried to have me on our first date together, but I refused. Maybe you need medication, too. Uh, Gianni got on my nerves. His pushy, touchy, feely didn't work with me. I felt like I was out with an octopus. Oh, I understand. You've had your fill of men using you. That's, that's interesting. Yeah. Noah in particular. I wish I could forget I ever met him. Well, I can help with that. Why don't you and I go out tonight? We can have dinner here, and then we'll go clubbing until we find you a man that'll make you forget all about Noah. I don't know. Oh, not... come on, I insist. Now go up to your suite and put on something more dolce vita. I'll wait for you down here. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Johnny! <laughs> You will not believe your luck coming here tonight. 
My friend, Fancy Crane, is in Rome, and she is dying to see you again. She is? Well, yes. She was very unhappy about the way your last date ended. So was I. I, I never treated Fancy to dessert. Oh, well, now's your chance to make it up to her. You know, she's coming down here to eat, so why don't you surprise her? I will. Grazie. Oh, my pleasure, Gianni. Believe me. Oh, one evening with Gianni should settle the score between Fancy and me over Noah. Yes, Lena decided to eat her young before calling and telling us what to do next. Try to relax, Noah. I'm sure she'll call. What part of I want this over with don't you understand? Look, I hate waiting too, but staring at the phone is not going to make it ring. I think we should get something to eat. And risk missing Lena's call. No way. If you're hungry, we'll order room service. Why don't we go eat in the restaurant? If Lena calls, we can have the hotel operator forward the call to our table. Fine. I'll make the reservation. Tell the operator we'll be in the restaurant in case someone calls. Oh, God, I hope Gianni left. La mia amica stava provando a riservare una tavola per noi. Sì, Miss Crane, vieni con me. Mm. Buonasera. Gianni. Il mio bell'angelo, biondo e bello. Uh, uh, where's Esme? Oh, she had to go, so it's going to be just the two of us for dinner and dessert at my villa. I'm abstaining from dessert these days, Gianni. I think you'll find my cannoli irresistible. Uh, um, better that you save it for someone who really wants it. Let's just skip dinner and go straight to my villa. Esme told me that you couldn't wait to see me again. Esme said that? Mm hmm From the lady in the lobby, Miss Crane. Let's eat a little something. I have no doubt we'll burn off the calories later. Please. Maya, I still think we should have ordered room service. Noah, we're here. Let's just eat. The hotel operator knows to forward Lena's call to us here. It's... Okay. All right. But I'm really not in the mood for any... What is it? Fancy's here.